Hi, I'm Thomas Kalefi. I'm a producer on the FIFA gameplay team. Hi, I'm Daniel Abreu, and I'm a game designer on the FIFA gameplay team. As a producer, we get asked a lot about customization in the game because we have players from all different backgrounds all around the world who prioritize different mechanics and who want to play the game in their own way. Some players prefer skill moves, some players prefer switching, some players prefer to defend, and some players prefer to attack. The DualSense Edge gives a lot of the ability to customize the way we want and to change the controller. FIFA is a fast-paced game, so you can benefit a lot from those quick turns and, you know, those quicker reactions. Even if you can save a fraction of a second, that can really benefit your gameplay. What I like most about the DualSense Edge controller is the ability to customize the controller in different ways. I think FIFA players can really benefit from the adjustment of the triggers. One of the things that I did was just go with the short stop, the shortest one that we have, and that just transformed my experience. Sprinting when attacking became that much easier. When you have to move your finger around the trigger or the bumper, you go from one to the other. It's just easier when your finger is not all the way down there. My fingers always rested at the bottom of the control naturally. So now that I have buttons here, it helped me change my gameplay tremendously. I can do things that otherwise would have taken me longer to do when I had to move my fingers. My experience setting up the Edge controller in the PlayStation UI was great. It was easy to remap the buttons, easy to change, and easy to select my preference. So I love all the options and all the possibilities that it has. It really comes down to personal preference. You can try different variations of your presets and just see what works for you. And the best thing is that you can do that during gameplay. You don't even have to pause. You can just switch your presets on the fly and just see what fits your playstyle the better. For myself, I have different presets for the two sticks. Within just five minutes, I had different controller profiles that I was experimenting with. We love to give players the option to play however they want to play and just try all different kinds of play styles. So what I think is that the DualSense Edge controller just adds yet another layer of customization that FIFA fans will really appreciate. I'm confident that players will be able to use the DualSense Edge to get the most out of FIFA and be able to find combinations and mechanics that even us as developers didn't even think about. The ability to configure and to change a controller to be able to suit your needs certainly help you improve your game of FIFA.